came home, it's my time. See him watching, they get all tell. It's my time with the niggas that you struggle with. For my dogs, for my city, for my beta click. Tomorrow's never promised. Son, no way I gotta flow my kicks. Anywhere, anywhere. Yeah. by the struggle. Taught me what I know. YouTube folks, what's happening? It's your guy Hitch. Hope y'all all enjoying y'all day. Happy Valentine's Day to you lovers out there. Um, aside from Valentine's Day, you know All-Star Weekend is coming up. So it's nothing but stress. You got your girl, you got your man that you got to take care of. And then you got All-Star Weekend and it's nothing but sneaker releases galore. And it started last Saturday. My guy PG dropped the PlayStations last Saturday. And they release through the Sneakers app. They release through the launch locator reservation joint through Foot Locker. And that was it. I think it was like seven to eight different stores countrywide that was releasing them. And it was hell. First, the Foot Locker app pushed it back until today. Actually, yeah, today to pick them up. You would have found out yesterday if you got them. I got lucky. God is good. Or... You could have struck out on the Snickers app like Snickers app like I did, because Snickers app just don't love me. I, I don't think I've ever want to draw on the Snickers app. Um, so that's how my weekend started. No PG twos, and then I just been waiting until yesterday. Luckily, my phone went off. It told me congratulations, and I got them. So I pulled up to the store, and ladies and gentlemen. Here we go. PG twos, PlayStations. Oh my God. Oh my God. These things are fire. I believe he wore them initially about three weeks ago when he bust LeBron ass, um, gave him 38. They beat. Cavs by like 20, 30 points, and I've just been waiting, waiting and waiting and waiting, and my God, oh my God, they're here. I don't even know where to begin <clears throat> when, when, when your shoe looks this crazy, so let's just, let's start with the box, so it is a newer box. Um, I'm not sure what this is, this design. It looks like maybe concrete breaking. I'm not sure. But PG2 PlayStation Black. Racer Blue is a colorway. And then the beauty of not getting an increase in the price. So even though you got a PlayStation collab, the price tag is still 110 Paul George 2. His logo. Swoosh. There you have it. And then Foot Locker. So shout out to Foot Locker since they didn't reject me like the, the Sneakers app did. And shout out to Trinell, young lady that helped me today. But there you go, 110 bucks. Now, where do you begin? <laughs> All right, so Racer Blue Mesh. This is not Hyperfuse. It is a mesh. It's breathable. It, it, it's a bit flexible. I have worn these. Um, so they got rid of the strap and you have these independent tabs here, which they call dynamic wings. Um, so that's supposed to help with the lockdown ability. Paul George did say he didn't want the strap anymore, so they got rid of it and they replaced it with these, these uh, dynamic wings. Now... There is no, I noticed that there's no fly wire in, in the shoe, um, but from this lacing, it does seem to definitely help in regard to your lockdown, and especially for somebody like me that has a wide foot. If you want to wear these loose, you can. With the, the PG ones, you kind of couldn't because of that strap. Even if you were to loosen it up, it was just so snug. But with that being said, 
I still went up a half size. So I did go to a nine and they do fit very comfortably um, in a nine. So if you have a wide foot, I would recommend still going up a half size. Otherwise, stay true to your size. Your eyelets have that PlayStation 2 controller feel to it because of the, the, the colors that they added. And you get that on both both shoes. So you have pink, blue, and then pink and turquoise. And then you have that all splattered throughout your midsole. So they really got this thing looking like a, a full-blown controller. Look at this. Look at this. All right. On your toe, has a real 90s feel with the baby swoosh. And then on top of, or underneath, I should say, they call this like a comfort zone. So this kind of is breathable and it also stretches. So it helps in regard to your lockdown again. And then a lot of brands are going with that kind of adaptable lacing system. Like on the Dame Lillard 4s, if you look at the previous video I did, you can see that. I'm sorry, the Dame Lillard, th the Dame 3s has that customized um, lacing system. Matter of fact, so there goes a customized type of lacing system, Dame 3s. But you get that here, so you have a lace loop here that you don't have to use. There are a bunch of lace loops on the inside of here that you can actually use. Um, so if you wanted to customize it, it's a, an adaptable lacing system, which I do like. Uh, with the Dame 3s and the, and the uh, Volume 2 Hardens, I don't like it because it, it just, I don't know, it just doesn't look good. It, it doesn't look well to me um, the way that Adidas did on those two silhouettes. Uh, outside of that, you have patent leather on your heel, patent leather on your toe, It'll give you some durability, which I like, and the patent leather comes all the way around the back, and it has the XO triangle and square, just like your controller does, and then you got your logo on the tongue, so zoom bag. 10 millimeter zoom bag, so the zoom bag is a lot bigger this year. Um, and again, I really do like the fit of the shoe. You can feel the zoom bag a lot more than you did in the PG-1. Your swoosh on this side is baby blue. Swoosh on the medial side is pink. And it changes up on the left shoe. So you have turquoise on the medial and then pink on the outside. Now, it has a tongue on the one which you had the booty on the, on the, I'm sorry, you have a tongue, let me slow down, you have a tongue on the two, <laughs> you had a booty on the one, so this I, I like a little bit better, it allows the shoe to be put on a lot easier, but you still have this booty uh, construction around your heel that locks you in, again, this is all if you're playing ball, um, to give you that comfort, I don't play ball um, in my kicks, uh, and then you have your power button on the back, because... It does light up. That's really dope. And because of that, this tongue is a little bit thicker than what you're going to see on a, a regular release of the PG-2. Now, getting down to some of that detail, you have his area code here. So it's 93552. Uh, Paul George is from Palmdale, Cali. That's the area code. And then you have more details throughout the outsole. It says mom on the right heel and then it has his daughter's name here where is it there we go olivia i hope that focuses olivia there and then on the toe let's see if i can get this to focus i can't even find it it's a t so there it is t that t is for his sister her name is Tiosha. So they added some more detail um, for his family members on the shoe. And that's all throughout the outsole. I love the outsole. It's the translucent AC bottom with your baby blue uh, zoom bag and then your baby blue PG logo. And that's on the right side. Actually, we're not done. On the back, just like your controller has, you have that thick plastic on the controller. You have that thick plastic on the heel that says PG-13. They really, again, for this shoe to be $110, and you're getting these added materials. And then also this beautiful addition. It turns on and then it also...
pulses. Did I do it right? No. Did, oh, no, I did do it right. Can you see the pulse? There we go. And it pulses. So this is powered by a Lith uh, lithuanium battery. I really want to know how long that joint gonna last because I man, when I wear these joints, I will literally walk around with them just like this. So hopefully the life cycle on that battery is pretty long. And then you have your left shoe. So all the same uh, design mechanisms, nothing changed for the most part. Patent leather on the toe, patent leather on the heel. Um, you still have the colored eyelets. The differences are gonna come into the details. So this is a voucher code uh, that you can use on uh, NBA 2K and it unlocks like features for Paul George. So that's what that's for. And then going to the detail on that heel it has Pops for his dad. Olivia again, which is his daughter's name. Is that? Why am I struggling to get this thing to focus? There we go. Olivia. Area code again for Palmdale. And then on this toe, it says port. Can I get that thing to focus? Port. And that's his other sister. Her name is Portala. Hope I pronounced that right. But there you have it. All your details to the PG2 PlayStations. Now, this is what broke my heart. I don't know if you guys have noticed it yet. But there are or there is a flaw on my sneakers. And I'll show you where. On your... On your insole, right? It's a PlayStation theme insole, and it's supposed to have a PlayStation logo on the left, a PlayStation logo on the right. And the same thing is supposed to happen on your tongue, and mine do not. So I will be calling Nike. I preach to you guys about quality all the time. And we pay a lot of money for these shoes. And even though it's a great value at 110, there's no reason I should have a missing or uh, the wrong logo on the left tongue of my shoe. This is supposed to be a PlayStation 2 logo. This is right. This is wrong. So Nike and I will be having a conversation shortly uh, because that is definitely a flaw. But I'm really glad uh, the shoe is worth the wait. These, these joints is... As I, I see it right now, and it, you can call me bias or whatever, but these are the best sneakers to drop so far in 2018. I'm going to act like Miss Cleo, and I think it's going to be the best shoe for the year, but we'll see how that turns out. Pretty women steady watch me Swagger must be timeless I put twinkle 